guys, it's me, Tina Marie, with True Meaning of Radiance. My voice is back. It sounds good to sound like Tina, okay? So if you're not subscribed to the channel right now, right now is the time to subscribe. Make sure your notification bell's on. Make sure anytime I upload this thing, you are alerted by making sure those notifications are on. So I'm at all these. Y'all know what it is. It's candle day, okay? It's Wednesday. It's candle day at the Aldi. Oh, they just repo his car. Mm -hmm. Okay, anyway, I be in everybody's business but mine. Okay, so we're at the Aldi's, and I want to see what the Aldi's has. So we're going to go ahead and get into the Aldi's and see what I can get today. See if any new candles drop. Um, I'm loving this series. If you're loving this series, definitely let me know in the comments below. But we're going to get in here. Enough talking. I'm trying to find my keys. I'm trying to be cute about it, but y'all it's somewhere in this big old purse like i'm telling you this purse is too much like i want one of those little cute little dainty um louis vuitton purses because this thing right here is just a boat and when i tell you it's a boat it carries everything in my life so sometimes it's hard to find things because it carries way too much like boom coin purse i'm over here thinking it's the keys it's a coin purse like mm, i don't know Anyway, I'm looking for my keys. Let's get in the store and I'll holler at y'all. I started the video in um, cinematic mode. Let me know if y'all are seeing this. And the shoes I have on are just my Noche and Gabbana slides. So let me know if this is coming through clearly on your screens in the cinematic mode. I've been scared to use it. And get out of my way. You're in my way. Move. Okay. Now I just put it in the regular um mode for filming so let me know you know which one kind of looked better i was just scared to do the cinematic i think it's called throughout the entire thing and then some people wouldn't be able to see it so this is just the here today gone tomorrow area and that's where a lot of the candles are housed because once they're gone they're gone like you can't get them again unless you buy them off macari or you buy them off poshmark or something like that um ebay third party third party sellers because once Aldi say they ain't gonna have it they ain't gonna have it because Aldi candles change out every week and they only get a limited amount of each one so I was looking for things and I went farther over um and I did note that they had these new uh warmers I was like ooh, and I wanted to pick that up but then I seen these I was like ooh. so they have these ceramic candles and I was like ah and I smelt them all okay now that sea salt and sandalwood mm -hmm. that's a hitter that's a heavy hitter now another one is the honey and orange blossom that one smelled good, but I ain't going to cap. I didn't buy that one. Um, then they had the violet and vanilla musk. That one was really good too. And then they had some one called leather and that was just gross. So yeah, I didn't get that one. But they had the one wick candles that look like the three wick candles. Um, so they have the same look. So they had the spring one, which was all right, the spring iris. Sweet eucalyptus. I mean, come on. It says in the name sweet. It was so good. It smelled good. But I have so many like it that I was like, mm, I don't need it. But um, the pictures that are on these single wicks are on the three wick as well. That's why I didn't just show them off because it's the same exact picture. Uh, this one I did not like. Mm -mm. That pear cactus? Mm -mm. That stank. Like, I know some people would be like, ooh, it's so good. But to me, that one was just not my cup of tea. And this other one, oh my goodness, garden rain. Oh, oh, like it was not good at all. And I know some people don't like when I be all extra with the uh, and all that. But hey, that's how I feel. So I like to speak how I feel. Um, now, these are the pretty ones. These all remind me of Christmas. Like this should have came out at Christmas time. Like maybe these are Christmas ones and they had leftover. Who knows? I don't know. But this is the Velvet Spice. It was good, y'all. That thing was good. Um, another one is the Balsam and Birch. Maybe these were the winter ones. I don't know. But this one was good, too. Again, Balsam and Birch reminds me of Christmas time. It's not giving me any spring. And then we have the last one, which is Paradise Cliff. That thing slapped. Oh, my goodness. That thing slapped. But I think these ones were $8.99, if I can recall. But whew, that thing right there, 
that thing slapped. I just didn't think the packaging was worth it. So I didn't get it. But what was inside smelt amazing. So that's that. Now let's go ahead and get to the haul. All right, guys. So we're back in the car. I just got a regular Aldi's bag this time. Okay. Eat toast. Okay. It don't, wait, no. What's that? East Toast. East Toast. Okay. East Coast. East Toast. Okay. That's cute. Um, but I wanted to show you guys what I got. Uh, the first thing that I got was this Huntington Homes sheet set. And it was only $12.99. So I thought that was really good. It's a four piece. It comes with one flat sheet. It comes with a fitted sheet. And it has two pillowcases as well. So I thought that was a really good deal. But I know we came for the candles. And I only got two candles this time because I wasn't feeling that new spring line. Like a lot of it was very florally. And y'all know I don't do florals like that. The eucalyptus one was all right. But I was like, yeah. Nah, I'm not going to do it, but I had to do this one. This is sea salt and sandalwood. I should have bought two of them, but they were $6.99. I was like, do I really need two? I kind of wanted to get two. Oh, it smells so good. Sea salt and sandalwood. I want to go in and get another one. You don't need another one, Tina. And it's only a two wicker, though. It's only two wicks. It's 10.5. And it looks like that. I just love the packaging. It is super, super pretty. No lid, which is fine. But I'm going to burn this one today. Ah, it smells so good. Okay, I normally don't do this, but I'm going to go back in the store and buy a second one. Because I feel like if this left and I couldn't get a backup, that I would be sad. And if I'm lying, I'm flying. And I ain't left the ground yet. Yes, I did go back in there. Yes, I did go back in there. And I got me another one. I was not playing. DJ Khaled. I got one of these left, and this is the pecan and bourbon. You remember I got the other one last night? Last time? Last night. Last time, it wasn't. This is peach bourbon. Peach bourbon. When I say pecan, this is peach bourbon. I think the one I got was pecan something. So now I have the peach bourbon as well. There was another one, but I don't think I was able to get that one. But yeah. That's all that I picked up out of the store this time. I thought I was going to leave y'all. I didn't leave you yet. But they had these, y'all. Lens cleaning wipes. I need these for my glasses because my lenses get heck a dirty. Like, heck a dirty. They be so dirty, my lenses. Like, it looks like it's clearer to see them without having glasses on. So, this is 100 individually wrapped wipes to clean your lenses for your glasses. So, I wanted to just show y'all these. Like, ooh. So, I'm going to be keeping some in the car. And I'm going to take the rest in the house. But... Yeah, I'm gonna leave these in my glove box and take the rest in the house. But I got that. And then, of course, like I told y'all, yes, I'm telling y'all, the sea salt and sandalwood, baby. Because I'm about to burn this down today. This is good after cleaning, I'm telling you. This is that after cleaning candle. Mmm. Yes. Mmm. Kitchen area gonna be smelling bomb. Especially after you just did the floors. Yes, this is her. This is her. So, yeah. got that. But they had some pretty decent selections. It was nice to see they had a lot of nice newer selection. So, I'm happy I went to this one. Again, this one is the one in Pflugerville versus the one I went to last time that was in um, Georgetown. Because I've been going to the Georgetown one consistently. And I'm like, ah, oh, Tina, change it up a little bit. Now that I changed it up, now I feel like, okay, I like this location because they was giving me things I didn't see at the other location. If you guys like seeing the here today, gone tomorrow area and that you enjoyed this video, remember, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.